What's going on, you two? Mosh Bros here. Kane. I don't know where Josh Mosh is today, but um, feeling a little bit hungry, so I figured that we would um, make a sandwich. Get our lunch on. Uh, we got, um, well, we did have uh, mayonnaise. Um, I like it rough sometimes. Abuse. It's fun. Got some bread. Uh, that I can't seem to open very well. One slice, two slice, makes everything nice. We got uh, here some Bologna. <laughs> they always make these really tricky to open. I just... Let's see if I can Yeah, there we go. There we go. If you can't open it with your hands, you just use your teeth. <laughs> well, if you wear glasses, don't do that. <laughs> now my, my glasses are smeared. I'm awfully hungry today. I can't really wait to get everything. Can't seem to find my bread either. There we go. There we go. Oh, here. Why don't I take my glasses off for a second? Put those down nice and gently on the on the bar here. So uh, if you've never made a proper bologna sandwich, uh, you take. Two pieces of bologna. Ow. Rip your teeth out, pulling the cheese open. Um, you gotta make sure that you get all the cheese out of the package or it's no good. Yeah. And then, uh, you know, you gotta, you gotta fondle it for a minute so you can, so you can open it. If you don't fondle it, it's not right. Once you get the cheese open, you always got to give it a little good, little face smack, or uh, you know, it's not going to taste as good if it doesn't have uh, beer juice on it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, screw all that stuff. What do we got here? Some jalapenos. You just, you just. Throw those on the counter. <laughs> Just throw them all over the counter, yeah. And then we'll uh, we'll soak up all the juice with the bread afterwards. That way it goes down smooth. Get your yeah, you gotta take your spoon out of the jalapeno jar. Open the mayo up. Mix that up real good, and that's a. Uh, what you call a flavor saver. Just throw you a big old glob of that on there. Get you a... And, uh, I'm not sure what I'm looking for now. Here, how about we, how about we, uh, have some mustard on there. It's right, it's down to my right. Yeah, there we go. We got a Get that open real quick and just give that a good shake and just yeah, just get that all all in one spot, just one great big old glob and you just get that there and that great big old bite of it. We got a Been, uh, man, that is a tasty sound. I'm about to have another bite. Woo! Oh, yeah. If that's not how you make a sandwich, let me tell you, you're doing it wrong. There's a lot of mayo on that.
I'll pin it over gum. The messier it is, the better it is. I tell you what. Don't, don't bite your finger while you're taking a bite of the sandwich. Shit hurts. Man, that really hit the spot. Woo! It also, it does things. After I eat a sandwich, this pleasurable... It really stimulates me. <laughs> so, next time you're eating a sandwich, get stimulated. <laughs> and remember, <laughs> if it's not messy, it's not right. Oh, uh, yeah, that's what I was waiting for. <laughs> All right, that's how you make a proper sandwich. Yeah, just, you gotta rub that in real good. Mayonnaise, if you didn't know, is great for the skin. You put it on as a pre-moisturizer, a post-moisturizer, an in-between moisturizer. You just, uh, you know, get it in there real good, rub it in until you can't see it no more. And then, after your sandwich, whenever you're feeling hungry, you just get you a little flavor saver. Give yourself a big round of applause for uh, joining in to this... Uh, Cooking with Kane and the Mosh Bros. Until next time, YouTube. Stay classy, San Diego.